Hello, my name is Netta, and I'm a CVS coupon addict. <laughs> no, for real, y'all. <laughs> y'all know I was planning on going to Target today. I just couldn't do it. CVS deals for this upcoming week is awesome. Well, I had a good time this evening. Y'all know that I can take advantage of my upcoming week's deals on Sunday, excuse me, Saturdays around 4 o'clock because my CVS is not a 24-hour CVS. So they have to switch over their prices the evening before. So stick around and I'm going to show you the deals that I came across this evening. Here is a quick peek of my couponing CVS haul this evening. Yes, people. Nice, right? My first deal, I took advantage of the Dow Bar Soap 3-pack. And it's two for $4. And when you, um, well, let me just explain what I did, okay? I went on ahead and got the two Dow right here. And... I they're two for four. Now I did have a dollar off two coupon from coupons.com. Okay, but it expires today. But check this out. In your red plum, the second red plum tomorrow morning, there will be a coupon there for your Dow soap. So first thing in the morning, get your coupons and round CVS and take advantage of this deal, okay? All right, moving on. Um, once you get that dollar off coupon, it'll bring it down to $3. Then you will receive a dollar ECB back, okay? That's going to make it two for $2. Now, y'all know it. That's a typo right there. It's supposed to be two for $2. Let me fix that right quick. Y'all, I'm only human. Mm-hmm. As long as I catch it. All right, and let me put the little thing majig right here. <clears throat> okay, there we go. These CVS deals got me all choked up. <laughs> so, um, you get two for two dollars or a dollar each, okay? And it's right there. Okay, on page seven of your ad for tomorrow. Next, I took advantage of the Colgate Total Toothpaste deal. Um, I explained this in my um, coupon review that I was going to try these deals out. And yes, they did work out, people. Okay, um, they two for $5.98. And what I did, I had a dollar off two coupon. Let me see if I can find it here. Here you go. There you go. And I believe most of these um coupons came out last week's Sunday's paper. Okay. So it was a dollar off two. It bring it down to $4.98. Then once you pay the $4.98 plus tax, you will get back $3 in ECBs, which will make it two for $1.98 or 99 cents each here's what I purchased okay okay beside it on page 6 um, I have the Colgate 360 or floss tip toothbrush one count um, it's either two excuse me it's two for six dollars all right and I had a dollar off two coupon as well and these are the same coupons I used in last week's um, ad I believe if y'all been catching up with me but yeah they really have been putting deals out so I'm glad you guys did purchase extra newspapers last week because you can use the same coupons in this upcoming week's ad and deals okay um, so yes let me show you the toothbrushes okay this is what they look like so you get up, pick two of them. Okay, you subtract the dollar from dollar off two coupon, bring it down to five dollars. 
once you purchase that you get four ecbs back okay that's just like cash people basically what they want you to do is take their money and use it again back in their store okay they just want you to um, return to the store and they're gonna bring it down to a dollar or 50 cents each that is an awesome deal okay people they have another um l'oreal deal this week and i did take advantage of it i know before yesterday i've never purchased the l'oreal but yeah there's some good deals out there and i think they're better deals than target boo now okay when you buy two of them shampoo or conditioner it has to be the l'oreal advanced shampoo or conditioner you have to when you buy two you get four dollar ecbs back okay okay let me scroll this up just a little so you can see it okay each um bottle was $3.99 and I purchased two of them again that's the only way I can get my deal and it brought it to $7.98 I use this coupon right here two off one okay y'all familiar with this um coupon all right um and four dollars off okay it takes four dollars off because I used two of the two dollar off coupons and it brought it down to $3.98 and check this out Y'all know if you buy two, you get $4 back. Y'all say it with me. This right here is what? Free! Yes. Because you had the coupons and you get back $4 ECBs, it made it free with a two-cent moneymaker. Okay? When I did the ad preview, I just knew this was going to be an awesome deal. All right? If y'all don't believe me, y'all go back and check that video out. Hmm? All right now. Okay, this here is another awesome deal. Now, I couldn't, when I was at the register, I couldn't find it in the ad. I'll tell us, I know it's up there, but y'all, my eyes not like it used to be. I mean, 40 is something else. <laughs> I'm sure y'all, y'all hear me on that. Oh, I'm telling my age. Oh, okay. Well, anywho, moving right along. Okay. Um, I did the Listerine deal. When you spend ten, you get five dollars. Five dollars worth of ECBs back. I'm trying to get this to basically clear off for you. All right. Okay. How long that's going to stay? And it's two per household. So I think I'm gonna do this deal again. It was just that good. Okay. I did get four of them and this is why okay remember you gotta spend ten to get five so I got four of them because they were three dollars and nineteen cents each would bring it to twelve dollars and seventy six cents I know I could have chanced it and it made it not something and hoping that I get my ECBs back but I didn't want to chance it won't worth it so I'm moving right along so then in the um store it was buy one get one half off now i said in the ad but actually it's not in the ad it was in the store so that's also a typo i would get that fixed in a moment which would take off three dollars and twenty cents okay which bring it down to nine dollars and fifty six cents then i had four of these coupons and i believe this also was in last week's ad okay I don't know which one. I could research it, but moving right along. <laughs> um, four of them, a dollar off. Okay, so it took off four dollars and bring it down to five dollars and fifty six cents. And because I initially hit the ten dollar mark that it states in the paper, all right, I get back five dollar ECBs. So that means four of them would come to fifty six cents each. Or excuse me. Four of them would be 56 cents or 14 cents each. Here you go. All right. And y'all know, I don't know if y'all know, but I've been wearing, I got braces on. So, yes, Miss Netta going to be using these. Okay, for my first transaction, my grand total is $47.13. My savings is twenty eight dollars and forty six cents so that means I gave the cashier 
$18.67, okay? But, check this out, y'all. I received $17 worth of ECBs back. I hand them $18.67, they gave me back $17. So, that tells you, out of pocket, I only paid $1.67 for all 11 items right here. Yeah. How awesome is that? Hmm. Ain't God good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep. So awesome. Before moving along on to my next transaction, I only did two this time because the one last night was a little bit too long, and I'm not trying to have this roll into two videos. That was oh such a disappointment. I was upset about that one. But anywho, I went in my first transaction with only $3 worth of ECBs. So when I put savings, that's in the ECBs along with the sale prices, along with the coupons or downloads or whatever I have that will bring down my totals is in the savings um, column. So that's to let you know the newbies know, okay? So with the second transaction, I went in with the $17 I earned from the first transaction, okay? All right. For my first transaction, excuse me, my second transaction, I basically duplicated the um, first transaction. Sometimes when the first transaction is so good and they have more than one limit on them, hmm, now they're going to try to do them again, okay? So, I went on ahead and did, that, did the dial again. I'm not going to really break um, them down like I did the first time because we already went over it, okay? And I'm sure you can understand, but I will give you a visual. Because if you like me, I got to see what you're talking about. Okay. Now, with the General Mills deal, let's move along. All right. With the General Mills deal, which is right here, it's two for four. All right. And they did have coupons. But I had the coupons.com coupon, and it does expire. I think it expired today. So I had a dollar, a dollar off two. So I did, I got two, two sets. So it's two for four. So I got eight. So it's going to be um, four for eight dollars. Okay. So with that, I had two dollar off two coupons from coupons.com. But in tomorrow's smart source, there will be a 50 cents off one. It's just the same as having a dollar off two so y'all get that y'all can use those coupons that's coming out tomorrow again get your papers all right um which is going to bring it down to four for six dollars y'all following along or a dollar fifty each and this is the 12.2 ounce boxes so yeah i thought it was an awesome deal now i did buy two more boxes but y'all know it's only a limit of four here I reached my limit, so y'all had to pay the regular price, but I'm not upset about it because my kids go through cereal like it's going out of style, okay? I don't get it, but anywho, at least my milk won't go bad, okay? Okay, then I picked up two more general cereals, and together they came to $8.68. Y'all see how much is a good deal to get two for four? Because two of them originally would have been $8.68 at CVS. Y'all know that's straight ridiculous. So, yeah, y'all better get them deals. Hmm. If I would have caught on what I did, huh, that would not be on my receipt. Okay? Hmm. I wouldn't even put it in my bag. All right. The next thing I did was the hauls. Um, I always tell you guys, check the aisles for clearances. All right? My mom, she having some bronchitis issues and she's doing a lot of coughing. And she said, Nutter, please, if you can find me some cough drops or something, please let me know. Y'all know how I feel about my family. I love my family. I have a huge family. And I help them out any way I can. So when they ask me to find something, hmm, Nutter's on a hunt, okay? And when I do it, I do it up, okay? So each bag, right here, you got 30 drops each. We're on clearance for 49 cents each. And I picked up six six bags. So it's $2.94. So, hey, anything for my mama. Alright, the grand total for these items, which is my second transaction right here. 
came to $70.60. My savings is $57.93. I paid the clerk $12.67. Now y'all know my savings um, um, includes the $17 I received from the first transaction, right? All right, just, you know, make sure you're with me. Okay, it brought my total down to $12.67. Now, check. <laughs> I received $12 worth ECBs back, y'all. $12 ECBs. So, that means it's like out my pocket, I paid $0.67 cents for 19 items. $0.67 cents for 19 items. Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> Or four cents each for all of this. Where well, you can find a box of cereal for four cents? Nowhere but Netta's house. <laughs> uh, next, we're going to go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and combine all of my CVS haul trip all in one to give you an idea how much I saved, how much I spent, or how much everything is worth in this trip. Okay, hold on. Before I do that, this is my receipt, y'all. Okay, showing you that I paid the $12.67 and got 12 ECBs back and y'all see those um, $17 worth of ECBs I received at the bottom of the receipt rest of the stuff is um, coupons okay the grand total for my CVS haul trip today is $117.73 that's awesome right savings $86.39. I paid the cashier on my pocket. On my account came out $31.34. And after all the rollings, y'all check this out. After all the rollings I did today, I came home with $12 worth of ECBs. So I'm going to scan here because y'all can't take my ECBs. I earned these ECBs. Yes, I did. Okay. So, that means out of pocket for all of these items, I paid $19.34. That is awesome. And I actually purchased 30 items. I should have put that on there. It's 30 items. Okay, let me calculate how much 30 items would be if I break it all down. So, 1934 divided by 30. So, that means each of these items will come to 64 cents each. That is awesome! Y'all, I had to put some pizzazz in that child because that's how I'm feeling. My baby got this cereal. Yeah, my mama got her hauls. Okay. Um, one thing I do want y'all to be aware of when you go out for these deals. Once you pay the um clerk, stand to the side, get out the way so everybody else can, you know, get rung up or whatever. Look at your receipt. I don't care if you leave the store and sit in the car. But if I were you, I would just go to a you know, go to the side that way, you know, if they got any questions about what's in your bag. Because sometimes the register doesn't print out the ECBs that you earn. And you have to tell the clerk, hey, it's supposed to be, I'm supposed to receive $3 ECBs back from this, you know, from this deal. And they will work with you. Um, just be patient with them as well. They will be patient with you sometimes. But my, my um, ladies that I deal with at my CVS, they are wonderful. So, you know. Just get to know your CVS workers and and everything going to work out. But please, people, please, please, I can't, you know, I can't address, you know, enough. Please check your receipt for the right amount of ECBs that you were supposed to receive. Because with my first transaction, I think my my um clerk had to print out basically four of them. I don't know because they was in the middle of switching over to the next week's deal or what. But please, 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 please look at your deals. Um, tomorrow I'm gonna try to catch up on some deals that I can't take advantage of because I gotta get my newspapers for tomorrow. 
And I see what I come up with and see what I can use my $12 ECBs on. I'm going to try not to go over the $12 ECBs because I ain't trying to go in my pocket no more. You know, I overdid it because these awesome deals and I didn't want them slipped through my fingers. So, y'all have a wonderful week, a blessed week. And God willing, I will see you tomorrow. If you have any questions, please go down there and ask me. If you feel like there's a better way I could have did this deal of coupons that I missed, please let me know. I'm here to help you as well as I need you to help me. i only been in this thing again for two months. I don't know everything and I don't claim to know everything. I make plenty of mistakes. So please, y'all bear with me. And I will help you as much as I can. And I try to answer any questions that come um, come my way. So please go ahead and like. See that thumb? Not my thumb. That thumb down there. Please like my videos. And please subscribe. I love meeting new people and new faces. Okay? So have a wonderful evening. Smooches!